Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we're going to show you how to make a delicious and healthy banana peanut butter smoothie. This recipe is perfect for those who want a quick and nutritious snack or breakfast. It's also vegan, gluten free, and dairy free, making it a great option for people with dietary restrictions. In addition to making you feel energized, the bananas, carbohydrates, and the peanut butter's nutrients and protein fill you up. So let's get started. Let's start by gathering those ingredients you will need for this recipe. You will need one ripe banana, one cup of unsweetened almond milk, one tablespoon of peanut butter, one teaspoon of honey, protein shake, and some ice cubes. Now that we have all our ingredients, let's get started with our smoothie. First, you peel the banana and cut them and cut it into pieces. Then we'll add it to the blender. We'll add peanut butter to the blender. You can use any type of peanut butter you want, but we recommend using a natural sugar-free peanut butter. Next, you'll add unsweetened almond milk to the blender. You can use any type of non-dairy milk you like, such as soy milk or oat milk. Adding almond milk makes our smoothie creamy without adding extra calories. Then, we'll add honey to the blender. Sometimes it's a good thing, but it adds a bit of natural sweetness to our smoothie. If you like, you can add some protein shake, but protein shake helps to boost your energy and improves your health. But, enhan but also enhances your overall health. Then, we'll add ice cubes to the blender. This adding ice cubes makes your smoothie cold and refreshing. You can add some few ice cubes to the blender, but adding more or less depending on your preference. Once those ingredients are in the blender, it's time to blend them together. or until the smoothie is smooth and clean. You may need to stop the blender and scrape down the sides to make sure everything is blended evenly. And that's it. Our banana peanut butter smoothie is ready. Pour it into a glass and you can add some extra toppings if you'd like, such as sliced bananas or a sprinkle of cinnamon. This recipe makes one serving, but you can easily double or triple the ingredients to make more. Before I close this video, let's go over the nutritional information for our smoothie. This recipe contains approximately 220 calories, 9 grams of fat, 
31 grams of carbohydrates and 6 grams of protein. It's also a good source of fiber, vitamin C, and potassium. Thanks for watching everyone. We hope you enjoy this recipe and give it a try at home. It's a simple and delicious way to add more fruits and healthy fats to your diet. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and leave us in the comments below with your thoughts and suggestions and turn on that notification bell. We'll see you in the next video.